Welcome back to the latest edition of New Lumber College Plays of the Week. And we begin at number 12 appropriately with a jump ball. Women's basketball against nationally ranked Gettysburg. Opening tip goes right to sophomore Margo Araprey. Four seconds in, it's 2-0 New Year's. At number 11, we're used to seeing great passing by the men's basketball team in Plays of the Week. How about this pass by Dallas Hoffman off the backboard to Nate Henty Brown. Just kidding, Dallas, that was the only shot you missed the whole game. At number 10, Abby Dalton at f and finishing 6th in the 800 and anchoring the second fastest DMR in the Centennial Conference this season. At number 9, a bit of deja vu. Dan Gaines against Washington throws it up, puts it in and the foul. And then three days later, it's Margot Aeropre, same spot on the floor, puts it in and won. At number 8, it's freshman Elek Ferency making his debut for the Mules and making a mark, setting the school record in the weight throw, the record that had been set one week earlier. He also recorded the 10th best shot put in program history. At number 7, the nationally ranked wrestling team wrestling with Daniel at Gettysburg late in the third period, and it's senior Austin Sherman taking his opponent right down to his back for the pin. The Mules won the match 38-18. At number six, high degree of difficulty shots by men's basketball. Dan Gaines goes behind the back and hits the floater. Noah Watson with the double pump for the lefty layup. Nate Henty Brown drives in, spins for the reverse layup. And it's Matt Ganias with the up and under against Gettysburg. Ganias tried the same thing against Washington. The first one didn't go in, but through persistence, he gets the basket. At number five, senior Jason Richwall winning the 3,000 meters by more than six seconds at the FN Invitational. At number four, defense leads to offense for women's basketball. Senior Emily O'Mahony comes up with the steal and does the give and go with sophomore Tara Zawalik for the layup. At number three, senior Dylan Schwartz was named Centennial Conference Wrestler of the Week for the second time this season after going 4-0 and recording 29 takedowns in the four bouts, winning two major decisions, one technical fall, and one pin. The four wins improved Schwartz's record on the season to 19-1. At number two, late in the Washington game, men's basketball off the defensive rebound at sophomore Dan Gaines up ahead to junior Michael Morreale, who finishes. And it's ahead to Morreale, who jams it in! And at number one, wrestling against Washington and Lee, final bout, it's Scott Schaefer at heavyweight with Muhlenberg trailing 18 to 16, and Schaefer needs just 35 seconds to record the pin and secure the win for the Mules 22 to 18. The Mules have won 10 straight dual matches and now are 16 and 2 on the season. That's all for this week. Thanks for watching. Back with more plays next week. Go Mules!